Obviously. All right, we're streaming now. <laughs> Obviously, I didn't understand. I just said pause. It's all good. All right, Fire Blaster, am I still lagging? Uh, I don't know if you're lagging or it's just Skype being shitty because Skype's always shitty. Can okay. you hear this? Yeah. All right, I that works. That's All right, so go back in the game. You have to rehost the room word. Oh, they they left. I'm trying to get situated here. Sorry, dude. All right. And... Uh, Fireman. So you got to admit is what I'm saying that I don't I don't play in that way that you're concerned that people will play about to make the game take forever. No, you weren't. You weren't Link. I was the Link can just run away forever. I I don't think that they can escape my Kirby forever, even for especially once I grab that boomerang. Yo, but you won't you won't get the boomerang because you won't get close enough to do that. I got the boomerang that game right there. Yeah, but you wasn't running away. No. Okay. All right. Oh. Oh. Yes. Free for all. All right, let's see. <laughs> oh, my God. Yo, are yes. you getting like the bad echo from me? It's uh, stuff still, still echoing. I don't think oh. it's you. It's. Oh, okay. I think it's. I'm pretty sure it's me because I'm on an open mic right now. Like, mm -hmm. um, I'll turn it down. I think it's stuff still. I I need to put my headphones in. Oh. Yeah. If you heard an echo, which that means it's not you. Is it no? Yo, I'm telling you guys, it's me. I know it's me. Just give me a second, I can fix it. I don't hear an echo right now. Yeah, I don't hear it right now either. I hear a little bit echo. A little tiny one. But it's probably not noticeable. Alright, go ahead and start your match. Ah, oh, what the heck? Ah, oh, yes! Oh no! No! How painful is it for you to play on this kind of delay, hipster? Uh, I really don't mind it really. Right nice. Now. This is fine. As long as it's not laggy, man. It's I hear a ship. It's gonna shoot fun. you all. Ah oh, man! Oh yes. Oh, with the beef. At least I got it. <laughs> that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you restart a match. Yeah, with, with quick match? No. No, I mean, you know, <laughs> quick match is so good. Right, that quick, quick, quick match is good, but it's gonna take a while until the whole community accepts it. No, it won't. I'll accelerate it, but I want to know how to access the stages. Don't die. What do you mean, access the stages? Alright, hold on a second. Because gotta... the quick match only yeah. does Dreamland. It, it, like, Here's when the match ends in the last stage, it's just like, like, uh, oh. I thought you could choose stage. Bomb to grab combo. <clears throat> oh, triple bears? Oh, balls. Link seems to be getting really good use of those bears. Yeah, dude. Polar bears, Kodiak bears, grizzly bears. <laughs> All apex predators. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> what are the What are the Russian bears called? Uh. No, 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 no. Uh, it's Russian bears. The biggest ones are grizzly, Kodiak, and polar. Hey man, I don't know if you fucking bear assholes noticed. <laughs> 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 Oh no! Oh my god, Oh, that was really sick. That? Get out of here. Fuck that man. Silent. I want yeah. that forward smash so bad. <laughs> so thirsty. Oh, that combo. Is that gonna kill? No. But. Damn. Is that in combos? Oh, like. Yeah, that's your stuff. Alright, that's it. This dude is about to get wrecked. Cigarette, engage. Cigarette, engage. Cigarette, engage. How do you Mayor, play with, I, with the cigarette? I was trying to do the, infant, the invisible oh. bomb glitch. Huh. <laughs> no, so much. Oh, this guy. Oh, yo. You got the same time in there. Let's keep moving game. Oh, so. you almost oh. got sniped. 
It's done. Yeah. No. Yo. Well, Link's so strong in Sector Z. Link, Link main should just be able to like win out of match. Uh, I beat him that Z. first life, man. You guys should... Oh. Yo, what if Link like... Like, if you play Link, you're, you're allowed to counter pick Sector Z. <laughs> What if you're just allowed to play on all the stages and not pretend that you're a tiny little... Except for Yoshi's. Man, just let Pango talk about my game. Here I'm loot. Yoshi's is stupid broken Come stage. On. I don't like Man. Yoshi's and I don't like Sector Z. Those are the two I actually don't like. Sector Z... I can see it being more viable than you. It's just so big, man. It is, but at least it's not it's so like unfair. <laughs> oh my god, this co you guys see that? Yeah, oh, that was, that was good. If you play the arena in Sector Z, it's fine. Just the, the, the right side of the stage. It's called the arena, man. Yeah. I call it the, uh, the de what did I call it when I was a kid? The tail? No, yeah. Man, like Kirby Death Pit or something. I don't know. Oh. Alright, Twilight Sparkle. Twilight's nasty. Except for Destiny, like. Oh no, she did good against <laughs> Destiny a couple of matches. I can be out of this one. Ooh, nice DI. Only uh, gets the up tilt on uh, Ness. Whoa, double jump surrender. Down smash and does a whole lot of punishing. Uh, Warren was no. Oh uh, no, I didn't go to Apex. I wish I had. And I'm about to win this match. It's Warren, you go to Apex. Oh, oh that should be a death. Oh no, that's oh. double jump to the stage. Really slick. Yeah. A ninja. <laughs> wow, man. No, I don't know. Oh! oh. Saber! <laughs> it was a damsel in distress. Ness? I don't know if Ness is a damsel in distress. Letter. No, no, no. Oh, I was just talking about like Twilight in general. She was like falling from the tower, the princess. <laughs> and just let her die. Gosh. Uh, oh no, did I get that? Oh man, yeah, every, every, yeah. every time a, uh, Kirby whiffs like the up B, it looks like he's charging up or something. <laughs> Uh oh. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> Dude, these combos. Oh, shield break? Oh no. Excellent shield poke. That tornado is about to cause some disaster for one player. <laughs> oh, good DI. Oh, wow. Can't. Both players. Keep copied by colors. <laughs> We've oh. synchronized by accident, I think so. Far. Right. Oh. <laughs> oh, I think <laughs> that stage I killed her DI. Yeah. Uh, pretty funny. Mm -hmm. One moment when you don't want to stage DI. That should be a grab. All right, or not there. Like uh, grab on middle platform. He, yeah, she, you could have landed on the main ground and just grabbed Kirby. Oh, okay. Oh, wow! Peaky fire in the neutral game. <laughs> this is... I, stayed, I stayed in it, because I thought it was going to come. I, thought I, I think that's why he stayed away. I Twilight pulls pulling out, out some stuff I've yeah, never seen before. She pulls out the most that... jank things that work. It's amazing. <laughs> well, she Yeah, she just plays off her read. That's all she does. She'll combo you with PK fire. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a. Uh, oh no, that's not death. Now it's death. Oh crap! She knows her damage is percentage is too. Like, she knows exactly when it's gonna kill. I'll take that trade. Yeah. Oh, can can oh that is the rock. No, my jump. This should be a dead nest. Yup. Oh, more That's stage. Yeah, I got her again. <laughs> yeah, stud went to apex. For sure, he went to apex. Everyone in this call went to apex except me. 
Why that? didn't you go, Umbra? Because I am like on house arrest by my parents. <laughs> Not I literal that, house arrest, but you're like on lockdown. Oh, how old are you? Like much. 16? No, I'm like 10 years older than that. What? <laughs> yeah. Are your parents like cops? No, but nothing is making sense right now, Umbra. I've had legal trouble in the past. <laughs> With your parents? Are they lawyers? No, like I've had like felonies and stuff. With so... your parents? Not with my parents, <laughs> like... <laughs> and how do your parents put yourself on... Oh, man. Well, I'm sorry for your legal troubles with your parents, whatever. It was oh. like, if I if I went to Apex, I wasn't allowed back home. That was the thing. Okay. <laughs> really? Yeah, that that was... And I had a way to get there. I have enough money to get there and everything, but... So it's probably it's like too old, like, it's it was just like... When I come back is the issue. Sus <laughs> needs to make a, a three game uh, win comeback. He wants to stay in the tournament. So we, here we have like, a run back of Ness and Hyrule. <laughs> oh, oh my god, I was expecting the most ridiculous comeback. I love that DK can even make that back. That's so ridiculous. <laughs> Oh, oh, what? what? <laughs> I tried to smash through it. Oh, no, we might time out this game. She just knows. What the fuck? Yo, man, I can't believe that has We might time out just, uh, just, just putting it out there. Yo, she tried to get it and almost hit. That's. Oh, no, that's, uh. No. Nope. Twilight plays very uniquely. Yeah. It's like a weird aggressiveness. Mm -hmm. You expect most Nesses to just like either like DJC bear towards you or just like run at you from the top of the dare. Mm -hmm. Bear to up air, like bear chains. Or, I mean, yeah. dare chains. No. Again. Uh oh. Oh. No. Absolutely not. Four or more to go. Uh, I need a stud up B counter just for like all your cumulative matches and I can just like keep checking it at the top of the screen or something. There was one. Oh, I didn't them off. What? Oh, the tornado coming in with the assist. Oh. Oh my god. Just a standing PK fire. <laughs> this will work. Oh, nice down smash. Yeah, really effective right there. Oh, I bet if oh. S had the end lower. Two, three more to go. Yeah. Down and forward, it could have made it. Ooh, good DI on stage. No. Oh. He just got through up build spamming. Oh no, the double! Oh, you bastard! No! Oh, arrow coming in, doing work! All part of the plan, oh. <laughs> no, I got nervous. <laughs> yes! Forward air and like. My PK fire is gonna connect one time. It's gonna be amazing. Yeah. Not it. Yeah. Yo, that approach though. Punish that yo yo when it's going backwards. PK nice firewall. Plank with the PK firewall. Oh, that movement! So it's like smooth. Ness is at a fucking metal concert or something. With her head bash. <laughs> oh. That is the best expression I've seen the Ness up there. <laughs> it's just like. Oh, that's a that's a really nice uh, tag chase on. Uh... Oh, <laughs> I think that's number nine or so I've seen all today so far.
Uh, uh, uh. Oh, that's me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, that's me. Hold on. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Alright, it didn't affect too much. I accidentally minimized Project 64. I don't know how that happened. <laughs> oh my god! Forward air to what? Forward air to uh, up air. I don't know what happened before that. Though. Kirby can still make it, ooh, we can still make it back, but, oh, that's... I just got wide-eyed very much. Here comes a comeback. Oh. <laughs> the single narrow yeah, bear sure will knock this off the stage. But, uh, it's risky. And that's just headbanging right there, I like you said. You <laughs> called me once. Do you have the quick match ROM Q? Oh no! The what? The quick match ROM? Yeah, I have that. Oh, oh wow! Yeah. Did I go for the smash? <laughs> this tornado, he like reverse baited me! Was that game 3 or 2? Yeah, I think that was game 3. That was game 3. It was? Yeah, better. The set's over. I'm gonna play uh, Um, okay, yeah, is this a, is this just a salty? This yes. Is, okay, just making sure. Yeah. So let's uh, I think we need to place the me versus Destiny. Yeah. So, so let's go stream that right now then. All right, I'm leaving. Says so sorry. You can restart if you want. Yeah. All right. Your rapid jabs are getting. That's a fine place to leave it. <laughs> Like rapid He's jabs. fielding up against the wall. Man, I hated to go down like that. Sad. Uh, I think it's. I think you have frame advantage if you forward smash a shield. If you use rapid jabs. So what do you mean if I just go straight to jabbing? Yeah. I can get a jab out before you can grab me. You're saying? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, dude, I was just regretting not going with the down tilt there. You know, it's more defensive. I played like two minutes there of straight cowardice. You know, at the end. To just to just lose to something stupid like, but that honestly, man, if he did that on purpose, it's high level. Like if the tornado wasn't there, I don't have smash. The tornado spawned and I yeah. saw it barely, and I knew I would kill him if I hit it. So, oh, that close. Where is Destiny? Oh, uh, you're in. He's in is, Chicago. Is he here though? Yeah, and that's like. Well, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go update, man. But that's it for my tournament life tonight. GGS. Oh no. I'm gonna join his room over and over. Oh. Like to see if that works. Oh, hey Q cool. man. Yeah, yeah dude. I feel like I kind of um I don't know, dude, like rolled through you in real life and then on like online, I don't know, were you just having an off day when we played console or are you like way better online? No man, I'm like so bad in both. It's just that online makes oh, people better. Oh, settle down, settle down. <laughs> online just makes people better, dude. I'm just. Yeah, what? Didn't you take like five games and wasn't that like unbeaten against your fox last night? Why? Well, I, I mean, fox against Kirby is just kind of. Oh shit! Umbra, I mean, Destiny's here. All right. All right, sweet. So I want to comment on this match with Umbra. Really Anyone else want to come bad. in here? Hipster or Q? Do you want to come and commentate or watch this? No, uh, we're. You playing? Playing against each other. Okay. Yeah, man. It's a good tournament. Um, and then studs are in. kind of lagging, so no. Why does it come in so? Okay. Well, I'm hey, gonna no, we. Uh, I wasn't lagging after we switched. All right, we'll come into Chicago then. Join Destiny's game. Yeah, my lag's gone. There's one thing I know about lag, dude. It's never gone. It's never gone. It's just waiting and. Lying and wait like a virus, <laughs> yeah, mutating. I have, um, I no, I mean I shouldn't have lag ever. And as of a couple of days from now, I'll have my own internet back again. But I'm wired and everything. Ooh. Wired up, everything's good. If Destiny wins this match, I'm really interested for Fire Blaster Twilight Sparkle because that's gonna be ridiculous. But I don't know if. If De if you win, I think Destiny is going to destroy Twilight. But I don't know. Twilight did take one or two games off them. I'm really, normally I'd like try the characters right now, but like I'm playing on three frames, 
So I'm just gonna go Yoshi. Hold on, I gotta. I, hold I on one sec, don't start. I'm gonna say. I gotta I change graphics speed. real quick. I think Twilight's in all. Hands down. Hold on. Alright, we're, we're good. We're good, we're good. Alright, good. All right. Yeah, we're good now. I just had to reset graphics resolution. Okay. Nope. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that's so that was on purpose, though. I don't know, man. I don't know how we're ever going to really learn the secrets of Kylera until oh, okay. somebody kidnaps an FU member you know, and just, like, beats it out of them. But I heard they never break. Yeah, I don't think Knight ever breaks, man. You're not going to get the IP out of it. It worked. Oh, All right, so we got a uh, fire blaster going with his um, future of Smash uh, Yoshi. Future Smash. The future of Smash, man. Uh, nice egg. Park play. Oh. Sorry. Oh, the leg spike. Ooh. Oh wow, amazing drill there. But you know, Yoshi uh, on Dreamland is very powerful. Much like that Jigglypuff match earlier, we could see uh, Fire come back here. Mm. Oh, gets barely pushed off there. That was a good use of the end of the super armor. Destiny really just one hit away. Fire uh, seems to be styling a little bit, not really taking this seriously. It's uh, hard, to, uh, hard to say he's wrong, having rolled through this tournament so far. <laughs> oh, nice four there, man. Nice. Uh, yes, Oh, do you have a jump? Okay. Got a jump, alright. No. Alright, two to four here. Fire uh, has some work to do, but... Fairly even. Like I said, I'm really, uh, looking to be taking it seriously. Kirby putting 72 damage on the board. Coasting out there with that there, taking some damage on the drill. Oh. Oh. The funny part about that was that I was rolling randomly, so he guessed random direction and it worked. I think I think rather you just happen to randomly roll in like the most. No, that that's exactly what I said. I rolled randomly. Yeah. I mean, it was still a correct guess on his part. I mean, like, he, you just happen to do, like, the general good strategic role. That... Did I parry that? That's pretty I, funny. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, I hear you, yeah, yeah. I think he should have grabbed, grabbed the ledge. No. You... Oh, nice. That was so fast. Wow, great egg. <laughs> oh, that was great. Alright, so let's see Sick if I can throw some of that top 8 out here and keep this together. Dude, that was like the sickest Yoshi edgeguard. Three hits. Oh my four. god. Send <laughs> dead. Uh -huh. Let's see if we can do one. Two, three, four. Ooh. Wow, this comeback oh, is so good. Oh, why? Mistakes were made. There. <laughs> Massive hit at 120. Oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh, that win, right? Alright, first match Destiny makes it Fire Blaster stick. Oh, sorry. He's probably gonna stick to Kirby here. 
And it looks like Fire's gonna stick with Yoshi and Dreamwind. Oh, barely misses the approach there on Kirby. Both players kind of dancing. Oh, nasty edge guard. I think I think Destiny's uh, getting better than Matt's. I mean, shit. Yeah, fire, really? man. It seems like you're just in, uh, you know, watch and learn mode here. Matt's is more standard. No, Destiny. no, Matt's is anything but standard, dude. Matt's is, really? is just hilarious. Matt's is just like suck you off the edge, and that's it. And just make no, no, suck no. jokes all day. Matt's, Matt's understand. Matt's is probably one of the only Kirby players well, I've ever. Maybe, I maybe I mean efficient. No, I don't think he's efficient anymore. Like, I was beating him up, like, all constantly for Apex. See, the thing is, though, man, like, Destiny is just one shade of Kirby. Very good at it. But somebody like Reeve, I just feel like Destiny has reached his potential as a player. Whoops. I think no. that he agrees uh, with that sentiment. And uh, I, I don't, I just don't see him getting, he's just going to be this good forever, which is incredibly good. I mean, he's gotten better. In the past few months with Kirby. Yeah, but I mean, he hasn't gotten different. He hasn't, I guess, learned. I haven't seen him learn any. He's. I still know kind of exactly where he's gonna be. I guess. Maybe that's because I'm not applying. I don't pressure. know, man. He's really good at reading. Well, I, I guess he just pulled at me. <laughs> yeah. That works too. I don't know. Perhaps. Come on. Get licked. Oh. Nice. Oh, recovery. oh uh, no, what? I'm not dead yet. Are we going for an up smash there? Oh, oh yes. great. <laughs> He's barely above the level. Uh, this is what? Winner's final? Yeah. There it <laughs> is. said Mads was standard. <laughs> Alright, what I, what I consider standard Kirby is F smash down throw. That's what I consider standard. And maybe it's just because he doesn't have to pull off anything more intricate against me, but that's what I see when I play against him. Matt, Matt, like forward roll and then like up to him. Yeah. Like forward roll, walk a little bit. <laughs> Slow walk. I don't, I don't, I yeah, don't. Yeah, buff for a walk and then roll and then up tilt. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm That's not a fan of the uh, up tilt approach, though. Like, it's the roll approach, it's not the up tilt that's approaching. <laughs> well, yeah, it's, it's not. It is, but it isn't, I guess. Like, you're sure you're approaching with the roll, but then it's like, okay, you're right on top of a person. What's the only move that'll save you here? Oh, the up tilt. As opposed to, I guess, like the killer run in pivot up till, you know? Keyboard Kirby. I thought hey, I uh, played on like PS2 yeah. or something. Q, man, uh, hipster. You think I can get in that game for a minute? What are you doing? Uh, Dude, I'm like I'm battling like... this fucking beast right now. I don't have any time right now. <laughs> no time. It's not took a long time. Uh, oh, that's it. I'm getting hated on by combo in my own stream. <laughs> Yo, hipster, would you believe that my original main was Link? Uh, like, yeah, man. In, in uh, 2000. <laughs> in uh, my, my original was Luigi. <laughs> <laughs> Luigi. 
Luigi main. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> you know what we need for Smash 64? We need like some chick with a guitar and like a folksy theme song. <laughs> like, um... Nice. What if I could say... <laughs> what would you want the lyrics to be? Like, does that matter if you... I don't know, I'm not a girl. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Falcon, song, main whoever we can get along, you know, that kind of thing. <laughs> Maybe if we pay like, a couple million, we get Lindsey Sterling to do it. Up smash down special neutral air. <laughs> yeah, don't, I don't know, man. Something everybody cares. Thank you, Pidge. <laughs> this oh. is winners' finals. There's only this, this is finals and Grand Slam. Oh no, get it, Fire Blaster! Nice. Jump, jump! Well, Q, I don't know if you heard, man, me and Wiz are releasing an album. And, yeah, we could do it. You know, um, you know, more of a collaboration, you know, a lot of different uh, creative talent artists. But, uh, nice, up here, uh, smart. The, the single, the big single dropping is, uh, you know, Yoshi ignores the hit. Uh, is, uh, is a great track. <laughs> Yoshi, don't yeah, get if you get a special edition going, I'll definitely uh, reserve that. Yeah, right yeah, on. It's in the same vein as like Huey Lewis in the news, only it's like Yoshi ignores the hit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it was just part. I mean, like the chorus is that you know, I mean, this is just stuff that I sing while I'm playing Wizrobe and. Yoshi ignores hits, you know what I mean? Like, it's, I love this game, but it's hard to do. It'd be like if I went to eat an apple, you know? Like, I go to my fridge, and I take the apple out, and I go to take a bite of it, and it just disappears because, like, fuck you, ha 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 ha. You know, like, I don't know, man. It's, uh, it's kind of a disturbing thing. I feel compelled to say. Stud's still, you gotta be Oh, out. come on. Stud's still... Oh, is that me? Alright, I'm done commentating for the night, that's I guess. Sorry, guys. Yeah, but I don't want that to happen again. No, it's fine. The, the match didn't end. You just left. Yeah, sorry, sorry. What happened? I mean, I did you do anything, or was it just spontaneous? No, I didn't do it. I didn't do anything. Other than start talking a little loud. Do it. That's ridiculous. Increase your bandwidth. Decibel. No. Yes. This is happening. Oh, oh my gosh. Nice. Clutch. Yes. Alright, we're gonna restart. Uh, let's restart. Yeah, these gra graphical anomalies. Oh. Alright, well, let's gotta make a comeback. Where were you, New York or Chicago? Chicago. No. No, we know host. No. 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 Oh, no. <sighs> Oh. What? Do you want to try to get two frames? I can't get two frames anywhere on any server. Oh. Fire man, it's very no! <laughs> Dude, that was not. I didn't pull my Ethernet cord out. I no, swear. No, fire. You're wired up and everything? What's the, uh, no, what's yeah, the game count? Yeah. That was not yeah. a rage. Yeah, like, that only you sucks. Have, like, the best internet plan? Is it 1 1 fire? It's 2-1, so uh, Destiny's up like 2 But yeah, and you have like the best internet plan? Yeah. That doesn't make any sense. I know, that's, that's what I've been saying the whole night. 
But I mean, like, is there some kind of other piece of tech, like some hardware? No. I guess there like an additional modem or a router or a physical no. part. It's probably just something I'm, with his I'm, ISP. I'm, I'm pretty sure I know everything that's like full control of my internet. Yeah, I know, man. I'm not down there. It's just so strange that you get you're just right there. Yo, Q, hipster, let me in there! Let me in! Mmm. Nice. Nice. Oh, also sucks. Wants... No lag. Oh. <laughs> gotta go high. against this thing more often. It seems like the standard Kirby like that, that Kiro likes to like use. I don't like Destiny's Kirby. I don't I mean I don't like anybody's Kirby that's not mine or Matt. I mean Steve has a great Kirby. You know lots of people have kind of that I don't want to call it standard. I think it's okay to call it standard, like, it's, it's what it I, is. To me, standard has such a negative connotation to it. I know, you, I know that it's used to like, just There's be standard like, falcons. There's so many standard falcons. Yeah, I mean, I, that's what I mean, but it's more like the go-to, you know, in my mind, where standard is like some kind of snarky... You know, I'm not saying it means that, but to me, it, it has that kind of connotation. It's just oh. the generic... Whoops. The one that, like, I don't know... Right, but I guess that implies that you can't, you know, like, do them with skill. You know, like, Boom's U-Air chain is tighter than, you know, That doesn't make it not standard, chain. though. That still makes it standard. Oh, oh. Yeah, I guess so. It just... Uh. I know what you're saying. Right. Oh my god, what is this? Come on. Thank you, Q. I know what you're getting at, man. Also, like... in addition to your, uh insights and the fact that I've been unbanned from Smash Sports. Oh, thank God. Uh, yeah, so uh, uh, I'm gonna go back to being no. a nice no. person. Not I thought you were gonna up air me. Smash oh, that would have been hard. Alright. Like, back air, back air. Is that it? How do I, yeah, how do I, uh, how do I mute a Skype call while I'm, when I'm playing? You just, Are you you just go to it? audio options and turn the sound all the way down. Where's audio options? Um, it is under tools options. Oh, I thought it was like a button. Really? I gotta go. Do yeah, that? tools options, audio settings. Oh, and fuck then... it, I'll just mute it in Windows. Yeah. I know, it definitely fucks you up because I. Yeah, I got three people talking to me about the same thing, and then like, oh well. All right, so Twilight versus you. This is gonna yep. be super hype. All right, where should we play at? New York is better. Doesn't matter for me. Like, I, I, I'm, I get three frames on any server. All right, I'm gonna spoof up a bit. Um, do you guys want to play team? Ooh. Oh no. Man. 
you just had me beat. Mr. Fire that much. I can't spell that wrong. Oops. No. How did that? Who's HS? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so, uh, who won? <laughs> Little niggas. Uh, Dustin. Alright. So, fire, fire lock? Yeah. Alright. So, it's fire, okay, okay. I'm gonna meet me on the Skype call. You guys are gonna keep be able to keep talking. Hey, uh, this is, uh, best out of five, and then when you guys number, you know the rules. Best of five. All right. Fuck his volume mixer. There it is. Grand finals is the um. All right, you guys need to talk to me through text now, Umbra. Okay. No laser lock. <laughs> is that what it's called? That's that. what I call it. Uh, Liz, hipster, that's good terminology, man. I know exactly what you mean, dog. Yeah, you laser and you try to out B, but you get stuck yep, lasering. I knew, yeah. I, I could have told you that, absolutely. Way to go, <laughs> man. Excellent terminology. I like it. Laser lock. I hate that. That doesn't happen to me very often, but when it does, I'm sad. <laughs> Nobody wants a sad hipster. Sad badger. Oh, I need to get some water after this game. I'm so right. That sounds good. I'm thirsty. Because of the salt? No, I ate a bunch of beef jerky and it was because of the salt. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not in the game. Actually, I ate, a, I ate a shit ton of beef jerky today. Like, too much. <laughs> Smart, I fucking hate you, hipster. God damn. Dude, sometimes it's not me being smart, it's just attacking and then instantly shining. That makes sense, but still. I'm just doing something. Oh, that's weird. Sometimes the fastest option is shine, so that's why I do it. That makes sense. Okay. That's why I said you would be West Balls, because you just do the most shit that you can do. Uh, I think hipster is going to be really good here in the next year. I mean, he's already got the tech down, he just needs to, like... That's what I mean, like, I, I just need a brain, man, I've always needed a brain. <laughs> no, but there, there is, like, you have the brain already, it's not that, it's just, like, getting good enough at, like, if you want to do cool shit with the basic moves, then it's just getting good enough at the basic moves, and I think you want to do cool shit with the advanced moves, and I think now you've practiced enough to where... I think that you have pretty much easy mastery over the advanced shit, so now you can kind of start to flow with it and really develop your game. Not a game, but your game. You know what I mean? Yes. Yeah. Hipster. <laughs> the professor. Professor Hipster. What are we doing? Oh. oh, come on. Combo. Not, man, it's not gonna happen this way. No. This is not my destiny. <laughs> yes. Man, that's supposed to be enough, Aaron. Oh, ouch. Oh, the shield break. Oh, oh my god. That's what he had. It's so stupid that that wins, dude. No, it wins because of Falcon's two frame invincibility on his shield jump. Oh. So you up smash out of shield, my shine happens during those two frames, and then your up smash wins. I 
I'm like 90% sure that's what happened. I'd have to see it, but what you just said sounded completely legit. <laughs> There's two frames of jump when you're in shield, like you get invincibility, you turn blue for just this. Yeah, and your and your shine is going off during those. Just during that one frame, so I only get one of those two minutes ability. Yeah, we just had it to where um, Fire Blast, that's what we were talking about when you guys came in the call, how Jigglypuff had the uh, D smash, and we looked at it, and it's 19 frames long, which is huge. Yeah, but, that's a uh, long dude, I didn't realize it was that long. Yeah, but like Kirby's neutral yeah, get up tech is like 27 frames, and you're invincible for like 24 of them. So it's like five frames either way. You still gotta time it. Pretty legit. And I don't know how to do that. Uh, no, not this way. No, what the hell? Dang it. I gotta get that water now. All right, water break. I'll be right back. Sounds good. Go, let me in prison. You bastard. What's happening? Nothing. You guys feel like rotating or just want to keep playing each other? I don't care either way. I don't know. Fire Blaster going Mario. We're going pretty hard at it, stud. I hear you. Do it up, man. I'll play her. Uh, how how good is um, Twilight, by the way? Is she, like, super good? She's uh, really good. I don't know about super good. Like, okay, so you know how they have gods of melee? I consider there's definitely, like, more gods of Smash 64. But yeah. she would be on the level of like axe and hacks. Ooh. Like she's not like LD I, level. I don't know, man. I think it's I, onk, you know. I think it's just like onk. I, she's on fire blasters level. Let's put it that. Way. I got okay. That that illustrates it perfectly. I don't know, man. Twilight. Yeah. I'm a lot of but, but, but Twilight can also like suck <laughs> really bad some games too. But she'll pull out the most ridiculous shit sometimes. If no, Twilight plays off a reeds, dude, I wouldn't be surprised. No, I don't think Twilight. I really don't. Who do you think Twilight is if she's all? Unk. 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 Nah, that's not Unk. Why not? You thought it was LD oh, at one point. Nah, no, that's not LD. It's I know it's not Unk. I've played, play. yeah. played, uh. Mario Party with LD and Twilight. And I've seen I've seen Twilight play LD in a tournament match. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Not LD, huh? No, I know, but you at one time did say I think it's LD. It's yeah, not. LD. He's playing Halo right now. But also, what you guys is how impossible this is. It could be a rotating cast of people that could just like be in like how hard is it to play one game of Mario Party to give yourself an alibi? Nah, man. I don't know, I've never seen anyone play like Twilight, so I think she or him is its own entity at this point. I think it's Twilight. I haven't played Unk enough to know that I don't He's I don't playing know. Halo. Oh, Unk is playing uh, Halo no. right now. Okay, so it's not Unk. Okay. I think he said LD was playing Halo. My bad. No, I think it's... I think... I have evidence it's not... It's a real person, but I think it's... It's definitely not a robot. Yeah. Oh, well, what the hell is a robot? I mean, you said it's a real person. Well, let's rule that out. Yeah, it's definitely not a program cyborg <laughs> that someone made play 64 with us. Um, it's not an alien, most likely. <laughs> Could be a hipster's dog. <laughs> Uh, I think, I think it's, I for real think it is a chick. Yeah, me too. I think she's cool. Whoever yeah. she is, I, I don't even know who it is, but you know, welcome. Yeah, no, she's you really good. that constant game. <laughs> what the f The reason, the reason I think it is a girl instead of a guy is because the way she plays. She doesn't play like any guy. It's Yo, the most I'll obscure play. fucking hey. play style. Hide that paper up, dog. Male versus female play style. Well, it's not a robot. Dude, I really think there would be a different play style. Like, say there was as many girl gamers as there are guy gamers, there would be a difference in play styles that would be tangible to know, I like... I disagree in this context, but not in all contexts. I I disagree in the sense that there's an effective way to play this game that 
doesn't has have anything to do with somebody's personality. Like maybe they like your personality can be reflected in your game style, but not in a feminine and masculine way. Like yeah, I just, but it it turns out that there really are no. If you, no, you can definitely like, play this game like a bitch. But what I mean <laughs> is, if you if you add it all up, right? If you get like a pure sample. There are no gender differences. What I mean is, like, in some species, you'll have male dominant, female dominant, you know, like 90 10 distribution. In human beings, there's functionally no difference. The only difference that they think in brain structure is like ancient caveman shit. From uh, we just react to uh, danger different. Exactly. So that's that is something that you can put into the context because of reacting to danger real danger. Like actual Dude, problem. real danger doesn't matter. When you're playing Smash, this shit is real danger. Yeah, this is like real danger. <laughs> no, I'm He's shining not. across the map. Smash and a Jaguar walks up. Like, I think girls on average are more creative than guys. <laughs> guys are probably more logical. Yeah. So, the reaction of danger may... Are you trying to call me a girl? Yeah, like, as <laughs> little offense as possible, man. I think that's just your opinion, bro. Oh, it's definitely my opinion. I'm not saying this is, like, based on any kind of facts. This is just all bullshit, my opinion. Sounds legit. But you have to admit that she has, or he has, a very unique playstyle. Um, bro, this is one of those times, man, where, like, yeah, I mean, I'm giving you shit about it, but... You know, this is oh, nice. If it turns out she's a girl, you can point back and you know, we'll have evidence that Umbra can identify people's gender on play. <laughs> I mean, I hope you're right. I don't know. It's just my speculation, but I'm probably well, I also right. hope you're right, so oh, I can no. Like the, like those Nest PK fires? Like who no. who would think logically to do that, you know what I'm saying? Like but it but it works. You I would I don't know, I'm right I think you're I think you're critiquing the male dominated current Smash culture that says like, you know, the care dance of the world that go around telling people to not do that move ever. And it's uh, right. effectively a bad move and you should never ever use it. I think it's silly. Maybe she just runs counter to that because she's a girl. Let me. <laughs> what? <laughs> I love this conversation right now. I want to meet. I gotta play Twilight at some point. Dude, she's on stream right now, but I don't know if you can be able to tell. If any of the instances that I'm talking about will come. Oh, up. I don't have a jump. That's fucking bullshit. Twilight Sparkle is that her name right now? Yeah. Or were they Chicago? Or... Oh, time out. Man, that's the only thing that happens to me. That was mostly because of the water break. <laughs> Have you the never water. played her, Q? No. I've never taken a game off her. I've gotten her down to one stock like 10 wow. times. Wow. Well, I mean, I'm not, I don't think I've ever taken a game off of you now I think about it. Off I me? Think she's pretty good compared to me. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. How many times have I played you, though? Um, uh, maybe it's a handful of times. I just play sometimes. Oh yeah, I have played you. Okay. Hey man, I know you. Oh, I'm bro, man. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta say, it's closer than I thought it was. But what are we gonna do about you and me? Are we gonna keep just kind of deciding it as we go? See, the thing is, okay, the, I, I, I've been thinking about this, that's still, the matchup between me and you, you have the advantage, but I personally think I'm a better player than you against more people. You know why that is? Because I don't play a generic, I agree with you completely, but unfortunately, that doesn't matter. <laughs> No, I mean, do uh, you hear what I'm saying? Like, so, I agree okay, I think my thing. ELO would be higher than your ELO. That's what I'm trying to say. What? What you're trying to, what he's, too, what he's saying is that... <laughs> if me and you played a hundred people, I think I would beat more of those people than you would. I have a very high ELO because nights like that Thursday where apparently Narwhal beat me like 20 times in a row and I don't even remember if I was playing because I was blacked out. Here's the deal. 
I'm the greatest Super Saiyan 64 player in the world. Well, besides that, let's keep that factor <laughs> out of this. I just took some time off, man, and the rust is coming off slowly because I'm old and my brain is dumb. You also play Kirby, man. I don't know what that. I don't know. I don't, I don't, means, well, I don't like know. My Jigglypuff is, is gonna give you some run for your money now that I know my Jigglypuff has like a better chance against your Kirby right. than any of my other characters. Right. That I always bring up, dude. In my like 15,000 hours, man, I probably have maybe one or two hundred hours with Jigglypuff top. Right. Nobody ever played her. Um. So I'm really weak. Yeah. I don't know the little secret areas to not be in. I don't really know the dynamic. I mean, I get caught by that down air just constantly. Um, and I'm really tricky about my up airs, too. Well, you know, you tag that combo, you tag that combo, it's all she wrote. Right, I need to go back and watch that, dude. I'm really interested to see, like, that no, combo. No, jip that up I will. I'm gonna reddit it, probably. Um, yeah, give it to me and I'll post it on the Facebook page, too, but that's... There's a yeah, lot of combos yeah, that were out throughout this whole tournament tonight that need some uh, love. I'm still trying to find the soul of that Facebook page, bro, but in my mind it wouldn't be bad if it were just kind of constant GIFs. Right, okay, well I can, dude, I am the GIF master, like, I can make GIFs for days. You, you like that page, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna go see, I'm gonna get on there later and see if I can make, I can give you, like, posting rights or something. Okay. Um, but yeah, I think that I think that that's a really good. I mean, that's a good name. Um, you know, and I think if we can have that be something useful and cool that somebody will want to tune in. Like, I don't want to have it be like, "What up, guys? Happy Kirby Day." <laughs> Made up some bullshit. Uh, but I think if it's like, "Hey, look at this sick Jigglypuff," you know, thing, I think that'd be cool. But I don't know, man. I still haven't found the social media base. Blah, 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 blah. No. No. Oh, you missed it. Oh, no. The laser. Oh, with the heal. Wait a minute, though. Wait a minute, though. Uh, 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 Umbra, man. Like, um. I'm really kind of sad I didn't get to play no. Apex. <laughs> you didn't get to play what? I'm really kind of sad I didn't get to play Apex because, yeah, I think that I get underestimated a lot. Because with, with what I'm talking about, about being rusty, it's not a John. I really mean that in the most complicated, deep sense. I can try to explain. Yo, man. Hipster showed me that I didn't realize that I was Johnning. <laughs> what I mean is, like, it's my mechanicals, I don't need them to come back, and in the heat of the moment, the mechanicals don't come back. But when, like, my shit is up against a wall, yeah, I can still focus on the player and just use my skill at knowing the game to just play a totally predictive game. And that's hard to stop no matter how good you are. You know what I mean, Umbra? You kind of lost me a little bit. <laughs> I'm trying to explain what you say exists. He's just doing a little, he does a little bit of adapting. No, but you were talking about a phenomenon <laughs> that you say exists, right? Wait, were you referring to something I said? Yeah, we're talking about whatever that stuff you said about me. Oh, about like, the like... I think I'm better than you against more players thing? Yeah, somehow how you think you should, yeah. What, what, however you're trying okay, to this is what I'm trying to say. I watched your hotel matches during the Apex thing, right? Yeah, and I was drunk, I had been driving all day, alright. Okay, okay, well that's all I'm basing it off of. That and the fact that, like, you lose to people in the tournaments, like, you've lost to, like, Smash kind of guy before, right? Yeah, sure, he went Jigglypuff and wrecked me. Okay. I've never lost to him, is what I'm saying. Like, there's. There... You guys play a five star game, man. To me, it feels like a short little quick slap fight. You know, I might lose some of them. I don't really kick it into in second gear until, you know, like stock. Okay, let me break it down a little bit simpler. Okay, you know how there's different character matchups, and in a perfect world, Pikachu would beat every character because Pikachu's. The let's just do theoretically. Pikachu's the best character, right? I disagree. You don't have to. You don't have to. You don't have to agree or disagree. But just right, like for this on. for this experiment, 
just let's pretend like the tier list that's out right now well, is is gods. Let's just say Fox is the best. Yeah. All right, man, you got to get better at establishing your assumptions, but we're with you. Okay. Okay, I'm just saying. Okay. Let's not even use names for it. There's just a tier list of ten characters: A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, right? Or whatever. I. And A always beats everybody else. Okay. But let's just say you play A and I play B. I'm always gonna lose to you. But for some reason, you. Oh, this doesn't make sense because of the first part it I said. It makes total sense. Uh. Geometry or basic algebra. It's called its infinite property. Yeah. If it follows logically that if A beats B, then B should beat C. Right, right, right. Okay. okay. Um, this is hard to state, then. We're that's not talking about that's numbers. Oh, uh, that's the secret oh. way to kill Falcon with Yeah, boss. I saw it with Combo and he's oh, down right. him. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, in a head-to-head -head matchup, you've beat me more than I've beaten you. Yeah, versus everybody. Let, let me break it down for you, man. Because it's not math. It's this fuzzy, abstract thing called skill, and it doesn't have to add up, so you can get these tangled circles. For example, right. I agree. Let's say, that I, let's say that you, so I beat you all the time, my brother. Not all let's the time. Beat I beat you two three. matches, and you beat me three matches tonight. Right, whatever. Let's say I beat, I know, Pikachu's the best character, and I beat you all the time, okay? And then you beat Hipster all the time, right? And then Hipster beats Q all the time, and then Q beats me all the time. Yeah, yeah, something like that. That's kind of what I'm trying to say. Or, Hipster could beat me and Q, but not you. It can work out any number of ways, because there's no governing equation that says it has to add up, unfortunately. Right. Even though your brain, sensing that there are quantities here being judged, wants it to be. It really wants there to be some kind of thing, right? You dig me? Oh, yeah, in a <laughs> sense, but... But unfortunately there isn't. There isn't, yeah. Yeah, whatever that equation adds up to, it should add up to Hipster having, like, Q's number, like, all the fucking time. It doesn't matter what Q does. He's like, he's, he seems to be five frames behind, but he's fucking 15 frames ahead in the end. Dude, Hipster so, you know, on his game is it's ridiculous. Good. You guys watch Dragon Ball Z? Yeah. 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 Okay. So... A lot, you know, I don't want to force a dumb Mmm, you're lucky, man. Life is like Dragon Ball Z. Life is just like life. Yes. Moving on, okay? So, Q is obviously like a mortal, but he's a god of Smash. Uh, and the point is, like, once you get to a certain level of skill in 64, you basically become a Dragon Ball Z character. And you don't walk around, like, powered up, you know? You don't come into the game all SSK2 and fused and hot shit. Man, I see what you're saying. But like, at Apex this year, I learned to approach Smash with a whole different attitude, like, with, with, um, getting to play Hipster in person and spend some time with him and then seeing LD operate in the way that he breaks down the matchups and takes away, like, see, that's the thing with Smash, like, uh, any, any sport that is a one-on-one -on -one confrontation involves the removal of options from your opponent. If you don't approach it from that mindset, then it's a losing battle. It's an you uphill man, battle. All I gotta mm -hmm. do is just say, like, watch my upbees, dog. Just, just, watch, <laughs> just, watch, just watch me watch. shine across the map. At the beginning of that... That's all I ever do in Keller. Yeah, or laser, but at the beginning of that lesson, you're gonna be like, those upbees are really stupid. And at the end, you're gonna be like, oh... I didn't see, but there's only one way to go. Yeah, I see. Oh, that's how it's like with the shine. Well, so there's levels of skill within that. Let's say the first level is like shooting your opponent or hitting him with a fireball, and then you know he's gonna be somewhere and hit stun. So that's like level one. Level I two is if you throw the fireball and he dodges it, but you limit his options to dodge it, so you know probably one or two places he's gonna be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. You're getting at but, what I'm getting at, but it's yeah. so, it's way more complicated. I know you know well, that. So, and then he knows that you know that you're baiting him, right? So then level three is where you're doing shit to where he doesn't even know that he's being forced into a lane, and he realizes it upon waking up in a combo. <laughs> you know, like, that's kind of the low level shit where people are constantly throwing fireballs to where oh, you can. Oh man. Now. 
I think El Deech eliminates the most options out of yeah. any. I don't yeah, know if any person. Yeah, he's of you when he's like. Like I think he he like he's very he let go. I think he eliminates like more him, options like than Boom yeah. eliminates options. That's for sure. Oh. I don't know. I don't want to be argumentative, but El El D to me is very is is very much a beginner. I don't mean that in a bad way. I think he's going to be the greatest. Oh, shouldn't have gone for the the grab. I think I think so too. I I can agree with that. It I think he right if he keeps advancing at the level he's advancing, he'll be the best in in the he, world in two years. He reminds me of me, and I don't really ever say that. Cause it sounds like a prick thing to say. No, it's all about when all of TR3 do the fusion dance. Like me. Oh man. I feel like Star King <laughs> is similar to LD in that aspect. Combined. Star King has a crippling handicap, man. He's got to get off keyboard. It's not even that. Like Star King plays similar to LD with the removal of options aspect. It does, no, 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 he cover he covers a lot of options. Maybe not removing. Uh, uh, what I'm saying here is that LD hasn't made a shift. He's almost there. I'm talking to the guy. I love the way he talks about it. But he's almost made the shift. What I'm saying is, so both people in this case, both kind of things are removing options, right? What LD is doing is he's removing. He's not really removing options so much as LD looks and says. Here's where they are. Here's where they might go. How can I kill them? No, no, no. I think it's more like. No. I think it's like, like he what? makes people make the he makes people make a poor choice. LD LD is all about pressure. Like if if Boomfin is nothing but aggression. I completely disagree with you. I think you're talking about a different player, or maybe he makes you feel that way. But to me, man, LD does not force them to make poor choices. I, I don't know. Um, it, he plays extremely safe. Like, yeah, that's beyond what, like, comprehension of how safe he plays. He doesn't let himself get into ah. a bad situation. Dude, like LD, like the way that he plays Fox. Every time you see him do something, like, like for instance, I just rolled against Q. But if LD did that roll, he would have killed Q for it. Yeah. Like, I don't know. Like, what LD does, in my mind, that sets him apart from everybody else, is he gets 10% at least more movement. On, on He knows the frame windows. He knows yeah, at least he does. one or two more frames better than anybody else. I agree he's, with that. He's on the joint. He just gets fucking further. I mean, I see. Th I definitely agree that LD's knowledge in general is, like, is way more advanced than the average... Uh, for, like players, point. even pro players, but I still think LD plays a mind game that's way beyond anyone playing a game. Right now. I absolutely yeah. agree. With yeah. You. His mind but games. Let me, let me finish my point. Which actually LD's like bad. just mindset as a player, like not just a Smash player, just like a competitive player is just so solid. Yeah. He, but he doesn't. He hasn't made the functional switch to. To like a third party mentality. He's still very much playing the game oh. as Fox getting killed. He's still in the Matrix, is that what you're saying? No, what I mean is like. <laughs> what I mean is like when I'm playing, for example, when I'm playing the game, and, and I'm not even saying this is a skill based thing, but I think this is what you have to do to be a player. Is I'm looking at like what's, what is my opponent going to do? It's not so much like, um, throwing out moves or whatever, it's just where are they going to be and then putting a hit there. Yeah. Whereas LD basically just... I don't want to have to buy an adapter and shit. Yeah, That's yeah, my, what my the fuck? Who does that? Love LD it. just gets to the best place to throw a hit and then just throws the best possible hit. Yes. Yeah, yeah. I agree. He doesn't... But he um... doesn't like read that you're... What I mean is when I kill LD, it's when I'm on the edge and I read him coming out for the easy, straight, amazingly timed shine kill. Yeah, but you you see how that's not outclassing him. That's just outplaying him, like in terms of the the, the frame of the game itself. Like that, I guess that's what I'm. Saying. Okay, well then maybe you're saying if we're if you're saying we're equal, perhaps. What I'm saying is that I I I think that that's him. I don't know. I think that I'm talking about getting to the level where people can outplay you, and I don't think LD's there yet. Despite being as good as he is, he's still transition. He, I mean, he's. He already views it as like a, a, a finite grid, you know what I mean? That you just move around with hitbox. Yeah, I see what you're saying, but who doesn't approach it that with that like mindset? Like he hasn't eliminated that last level. 
Mm, he still, nice. that he still feels like he's Fox instead of that's I just think, where his control point is. It's are, not you just, are you just saying that he's accepted the limitations of Fox, like, you know, as part of, like, no, 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 what he's no, got to no, deal no. with? No, no, no. What, what I'm, we're very close. What, what, exactly what you just said, except... That's what I've just, done as a Fox, and I used to accept his weaknesses. And He hasn't yeah, peeled faster. away the last layer of the onion. He's still, he's still playing yeah. Fox, playing Super Smash Brothers instead yeah. of... Fox has the best new Super game, Smash. man. Crazy. Fox is the best. Fox is the best character for a brainy player by far. Oh bullshit! No, that's wait, what'd you true. say? He's the best. He's, what? The, he's the best character for a, somebody who approaches this game like it's chess or like has has the has the has. Yeah. What do I okay, say? I definitely see that. Has a has a knowledge of how to manipulate an opponent or how to construct a win. Neutral yeah. game. Like, or you gotta, yeah. not, Fox. This is anthropomorphic best wearing. Anthropomorphic, do you know what that word means, man? It doesn't mean what you think it means. Character racism. I was <laughs> I'm sorry, you know, I'm sorry, man. I had to lay some data. <laughs> anthropomorphic. What does that mean? That it means, means like... uh, animals that uh, act like uh, uh, an analogy. You make an analogy between an animal. Are you guys streaming Destiny versus uh, Twilight? Yeah. Yeah. You want to get in here? A neural spread. Sure. What What's the partner word with it? What's the other one I just had in my brain? Personification. Ant what? Personification. Yeah. Right. Exactly. So personification oh, is taking human traits and applying them to them, where anthropomorphism is taking animal traits and applying them to human. No, man. You want to just play C2P? This is taking all these yeah, time out. Yeah. As long as you can host. Yeah, well, I can host. Mode, host right he's now. a douchebag pilot. In a vest that failed not only his father but his whole fucking planet. I'm hosting. And for some reason, he acts like a fox. <laughs> so I guess I did use. I want to get back on people that play similar to LD in that yeah. aspect of like chess play. Because that's my goal, you know. Who other? Pl that's, what other that's players? How I this game. What other players do you think play similar to that style? I just always want to overwhelm my opponent, no matter who. Yeah. See, and man, like, you know, who I plays? I have better tech skill, so I win, no matter who I'm fighting. Right. I have better character control than them. You yeah, guys are, uh, you're it's fading into incorrectness by simple generalization, man. I think that LD and Hipster and others are to the point where. You know, they're just so good that you can't play like that. I mean, we all have to agree that people have... There's certain play styles, right? Like, there's aggressive play style, there's campy play style. And then you can like subdivide that into more things. Like, we're trying to say LD is a very chess-oriented, logical player. Okay, I have an example. Um, but the problem is that most of the examples are just going to be other Fox mains, like Night Fox. Mm -hmm. He is... Exa exactly, oh, not exactly, but he has the same exact mindset as as LD, and that he's super efficient. He he plays the space. He knows when to come in and when to leave and pick his battles. Yeah, you see, I don't. You guys have this complicated view of the game, but I'm not like. I like, like to make it complicated. Like yeah, that. me too. It's 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 like when you when you incorporate personalities and the people who play this game. That that's what makes it complicated. It's a complex no, game. But I don't think I think you walk too far down. No offense intended. I think you walk too far off that plank. I think you're no longer supported. But um, I, you want to get delve as deep as possible, right? I absolutely, man. But you can't. We and can't. Like, say I paint a picture that's just a rainbow. You know, you can go on and on about stuff, but at the you know, it could just be making that up. What I'm saying what? is, I think that when you start to talk about like personality differences and, and, and place that, let me explain myself better. So how I judge people is not on wins and losses or on play styles or, or, or whatever. It's on how tight they are with the moves in real time. Move by the I mean, uh, that definitely happens in on the fly in the game, but what leads up to that? What is in their mind that makes them make these decisions? Sure, right. That's what I'm trying to get to. I'm trying to like break it down no, 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 I know. further. Exactly, I'm bro. Bear, bear with me though. You're stepping back another level. What no, I'm, I'm not. I'm stepping no, in. That's another level in, man. 
No, I'm describing the base level of skill. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to delve game. deeper into the atomic structure of why the people do those certain things. Sure, but you might lose meaning if you don't. No, I'm, well, I might lose certain meanings, but I'm trying to... Holy shit, did you ever see that? Yeah, that was sick. Weak, fair. I'm not saying your argument is ridiculous. I'm just trying to establish that what I'm talking about is like the functional base level of skill in this game. Is how tight. That's when we say LD has extra movement. That's what we mean. That he gets the. You know what I mean? He gets it closer to that. If the game says, "Hey, you're recovered," LD's right there on that frame. Everybody else in the world is a frame or two behind. I. I'm not okay, Star King. I'm not trying to divide them into like concrete playstyles. I'm trying to incorporate why they make the decisions they make. Oh no, down. Ah. Umbra, you know what you should do? Like Star King, for instance, I think you play very logical and you make the best option, like the best action for an option. Like you know. Well, most of the time, at least. Oh, dude, dude, this jiggly folk. Oh, sorry, okay, I thought you were just screaming at me. <laughs> One of the first times I ever played SK, he got a teleport sing on me on a tech chase on my box, and I thought it was the sickest thing. Because <laughs> that, was the, first time, that was the first time anyone had ever gotten it to me in a match, besides on console. Let me, uh, let me use Link as a great example here. You can tell. When you're playing a link, somebody that's throwing out bombs or boomerangs in a very good pattern. Right? Using my link as an example here, stud. Yeah, because it's a great one, and you nice understand man. it, so you'll probably, you know, get the point. Uh, you know, you can tell. I don't know how to put this into not. words, but you can tell when you're playing a link that's just throwing out, let's say, good coverage, may or may not be hitting you, and a link that's throwing out boomerangs and bombs that are specifically placed to hit. You. Not that either one is good or bad, they're both right. good. But you can just tell when someone is crafting it around me. And what I'm you saying is. You are eliminating right now, options. Right, what I'm saying is right now, LD is still that guy that is throwing out. Yeah, my whoa, 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 he's whoa, throwing whoa. out the best generic bomb. Absolutely. But he's still just throwing out that generic stuff instead of using his. <laughs> to absolutely crush the shit out of his opponent with I follow his now on. I rest. I meant to go to Dreamland, I just like wanna change my color or something like that. Uh oh. I can, I can L play Dreamland LD all has said day. to me personally he feels like he's Where's functionally he functionally he can do what he needs to do. So I think yeah. that's kind of what you're trying to say is he's still very like generic in his approach to what he's doing. Is is not as creative, is that what you're trying to kind of say? No, no, LD's, LD's... Cause actually, he, no, Because he's I not very right creative. Now, in, I have conversations with, like, you said he didn't do, if you kind of, kind of, maybe understand this, if you get the I talked to LD for, like, uh... Yeah, you, we all know LD. Six or eight hours straight or something. Right, we all know LD, so... so I'm not on the same right. TV at Apex for, like, ever. Yeah, what, what I mean is, what I think is that LD himself is not, I'm not... Did you know that was Stick Hops, Fox can double jump up to the top part from a high roll? Really? What? Yeah, with, yeah, with Stick early. Hops you can. It's retarded. So can Why? Captain Falcon. Why, man? You can't camp, it's great. People need I just want to know, I just want to tell you guys, because I didn't know that until a couple days ago. Alright, Q, hipster man, where'd you guys go? Uh, we're wearing P2P now because I got tired of the timeouts. Oh, I forgot that timeouts were a thing. Thought I love you, man. Alright, well anyway, my point with LD is that if you talk to him, you understand it. Is that he is not trying to be creative. Nope. He's yeah. just trying to learn the fastest, most efficient way he can do things. He's approaching 100% knowledge of that. That may be a different philosophy, but what's your point here? Like, My what point about is that? He's, he's approaching 100% knowledge of that. And he's very close to understanding absolutely everything that Fox can do, maximum. See, I... 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 I have to look he's at moved it. Moved to OG. He's moved to console. Right? Like he's, no, he's playing on adapter though. 
Yeah, yeah but he, not at Xanadu, dude. Not that was for Apex only. Well, he's gonna get his own. I think at Zenith you'll see him on OG. No, he'll be on Adaptive. No, he's not gonna. Not that at this point. No, he's one thousand percent gonna be on Adaptive. All right, hipster, I'll, I'll bet you double or nothing on a Smash match. I'll bet five bucks. On the him. most I, I, the closest yeah, I'll see it will be him on a Hori pad. No. He and I doubt that. Xbox. He'll be on a 360 controller. Yeah, he's yeah, gonna be on Xbox. Hey, Umbra, I wanna I'm probably gonna be on Xbox. I hope so, man. What'd you say, yeah, you Studs? I said, let's, uh, let's play some on stream after the tournament, man. I wanna do something. It's not even to, like, prove that I'm, like, good or anything. I just wanna play my full power on console, because it's right. more fun. Right. Yeah. Oh, dang it. Console is a lot different. I just want to feel 100% comfortable when I play on console. Yeah, so, so to wrap my point up, when LD gets there, that's it. Then he trans Then he knows everything he has to do with Fox. He breaks through to the final level, which uh, is... I'm sorry, Stud. I don't know if I agree with what you're saying. Like, for me, like, um, LD has the raw skill, maybe, but the last variable that he will never come to understand is the choice of a human being. And the only way that he can manipulate those choices is with his current play style. He's going to keep getting better at manipulating you. people and maybe eliminating those options, but I don't think that... I agree with you. I think that he has no fucking idea what you were talking about. If you just said what you just said, which I totally understand and agree with, I think that I've said just as much to LD, to his face, and you get like this puzzled look. No, man. What are you talking about? I talked to him too. Like, he, no, I'm he's not one of the most open people. Like, no, 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 no. I'm not saying because he's no, stupid. No. I'm saying because he doesn't, at this point, I think, value that. I don't know, man. I just don't think he's focused on that. I dig what you're saying. I, that's how I play. Exactly what you just said. That's the only way. Right. Having already mastered. Well, I've lost that. But LD play, you know, he will play that Having mastered Fox, that's the only. <laughs> How do you make your decisions? Once it's not based on, I think I can get this far. Once you know exactly how far you can get, you can access that in real time, then it becomes what you just said. It's just where your opponent is going to be yeah. and hitting them while being as unpredictable as possible yourself. You, for me, for me, the improvement of skill is analogous to the ability to eliminate options. And I don't know if I, I argue from that point as someone like, you're leaving off the end of that sentence, which is what I'm saying he's about to reach to, and the unsaid part of it is, and being there to strike them, you know. Right. One, right, like. I, maybe it's just the way that I approach it, approach this game in general. Like, um, I don't want to sound like a dick, but as as a as a tennis player, like you you learn the art of constructing a point. You know, you, the the ability to build yourself to the open winner. To me, that's what LD aspires to. He he's less concerned with the quickest way to kill people and more concerned with the open winner. Now, if I can, if I can use that terminology off. right now. Yeah. LD is setting up his own shots. When yeah. he sets up points, he's setting it up so that he can have this great shot at the end. What I'm doing and what everyone does at the next level is they set up points to hit them where the, at the very end their opponent cannot reach it. Right. LD is not at that level yet. These two have the same exact effect 99% of the time. It's merely mindset. But do you understand? Yeah, I do. Right, like, so, I'm with you. That's a great analogy, man. Tennis is, uh, very unique as a sport. Right. That's why I fucking love it, man. Oh, that's, that's it's dope. I was chess. wondering why you looked, uh, so in shape, man. <laughs> Don't <laughs> fucking try that shit with me, dude. Yo, what happened? Tennis, 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 uh, make me annoyed. I'm glad you're not comparing it to chess right now. Yo, we, uh, we used to have a joke about, uh, you know, it's either chess or Tetris being like the uh, Hitler comparison of the nerd world, you know? So like, um, like we had this one guy, I swear to God this happened, he was drunk, and uh, he pushes up his glasses on his nose and goes, Tetris is a lot like chess, man. And I mean, he went on, we, I walked away, but... <laughs> He said it like it was a thing that someone would say. 
<laughs> it wasn't satirical. <laughs> it's just a lot like chess. But you can't de eye that, man. Fire, I don't even think he was talking about, like, in the comparison. Either. I think he meant, like, literally going to be, I don't know, the pieces versus the blank space. I mean, like, I could get really bright here and try to invent a point for that to be supporting. <laughs> I don't think that that was the one he had. <laughs> but yeah, the glasses push up. So then, it, we, I remember this exactly because it was so great, because then we would always just, you know, if we didn't want to deploy the full version, you could just look at somebody and just fake push your glasses up on it. Just like you. Anytime somebody said something that was total horse shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Who is that, Alfra? Am I gonna explain? talking this? about, like, uh, I'm sorry. No, go ahead, man. I was just and gonna Alfra, you something. understand, and Fire Blaster, too, man, like, you're really into logic. Like, I dig that, and everybody digs it. You and me, Fire, get along in a lot of these conversations where people are obviously fucking stupid, and all you have to do to be correct is just be like, hey, you're clear, like you're over there saying Tetris is a lot like chess, bro. Like all you have to do is just restate what they're saying. <laughs> <laughs> like that like guy on the corner saying the world is gonna end right now. All you have to do is just stand next to him, and you've won that argument like, just by being there. People will drive by and be like, "That guy's right." No, airlock. But you can just use words to say any kind of meaningless bullshit you want. And sometimes it's even well formed. Just to finish up a thought I had earlier, like... Wait, did why he... did Destiny drop? Is he, uh, did he win already? I thought I that was it. That's it? I thought so. You, you got tournament interrupted. That's alright. I'm very patient. Oh, oh man. No, I gotta focus for a second. Hang on. But I gotta finish this match in style. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, um... 2-1? Oh, she, she won one. Did you guys, uh... No! So you guys said we got some DBZ fans out there. I don't know. I, um... Uh, you know, Smash, again, is a lot like DBZ, man. <laughs> I think it's like more like Yu-Gi-Oh, like you man. You can't beat Isaiah, you know? I mean, I'm, I don't mean to no. brag with you, Fire, but... Smash you know, is like Yu-Gi-Oh. Like, sometimes you, like, uh... There's a couple episodes where you, like, let them live out of pity, and then you just no, get screwed up. Or, like, you just, like, sleep on them, and then you lose. Oh, like, anybody can, I mean, you know, I fire's top eight, right? There are people that said I deserve my 193rd rank at Apex. And, uh, you know, I, I know, okay, so John's out of the way, it's online. Like there's that episode with that guy, Panic, he just lives in darkness and fear. And then when you, like, knock his fear down, he just breaks down and he loses. So, yeah, so I took two games off of Fire Blaster, man. But anyway, my point is, the best fucking fight wow. in DBZ from an underdog is when Cell is, like, trying to kill everyone. Like, Cell's pissed off. I think he downformed a little bit. And he's really about to start eating the children. And fucking TN stands up and for an entire 30-minute episode beats the fuck out of Cell. Did you guys see that one? Do you know what I'm talking about? Probably, that was like 10 years ago, but yeah. Okay, <laughs> every single one of you just lost rights to tell people you like Dragon Ball. I don't, I don't, I don't say I like Dragon Ball. I, I hate watching that show. I watched like, it in middle picks. school. It came out in like 1999, dude. Like, I, I had to watch five episodes for a plot point. Like, yeah, man, everything that came out in 99 is gay, right? No, I'm just saying it came out a long time ago. I don't recall everything in that show. Damn, 99 was what, like 15 years ago? What else came out in 99? Your mom. <laughs> I feel like every... Oh, it's such a hard combo, man. Yo. Smash kind of guy Combo. knows what you mean, stud. He says he remembers Combo that fight. What game? He's making fun of me, man. Don't even worry about it. Pokemon Puzzle League? I don't yeah, know. I'm gonna get that Combo you'll find you eventually. I'm gonna get 
I'm yeah, week up there, and then I'm gonna land on the top platform, and then I'm gonna be able to fastball again with the week up there. <laughs> it's gonna be the coolest thing. Yo, hipster, I had enough of this treatment at Apex, man. I won't stand for any more of it, man. This is kind of yeah, I'm afraid. I need somebody to wreck. Oh, what? What was I gonna say? Oh, oh yeah. You know, po Smash no, Bros. So I like Pokemon. You just gotta catch them all. So, well, uh, just what I was gonna say earlier, like for me, Smash has always been less like chess and much more like tennis because, like, tennis implies the pace, right? The speed of like you have so much time in chess to choose. Smash has nothing to do with chess. You're absolutely correct. Chess is turn based. Yeah, I'm, Smash I'm done talking about that. Dynamic real time game. It's chess? ridiculous comparison. You have to play fighting games with chess all the time, and that's pretty stupid. Chess yeah, is man. very little like fighting games. I you know what's know. a lot like chess? Fucking chess. It's probably one of the more unique things ever developed. In my I mean, you know, if you take all the possible games of chess, right? And and like people talk shit about that. They're like, oh, well, what about the ones that would never happen? You know, with like pawns in the starting line. Okay, so get rid of all those and just talk legal possible games of chess. All right. There's like, I don't know, man. Something like 10 to the factor of 40 times more of those than there are particles in the fucking universe. Like, it, it's, it's not, there's not, it's chess, dog. Nah, chess, chess isn't even close to, like, comparison to, like, fighting games, because there's, it's just so different, it doesn't, it doesn't make sense. Oh, this beat jerky made me so soft, man. <laughs> chess, fighting games and Smash Bros, I mean, I'm, gonna, I'm calling Smash Bros a fighting game, so, like, fighting games are a lot, like, more like poker than anything else. Hey, man, Tetris is I can a lot see that. Poker, there's so many aspects that poker shares with fighting games. Yeah, like, like getting on tilt, reads... Hey, look, if you play oh, well. poker, my analogy holds for poker. It's the diff and I know poker pretty well. I dealt at a card. So you probably, you probably agree that it's like they're very similar. I have a lot of aspects to this Well, show. they're similar at the level that uh, I'm, yeah, if you degrade that first level and call it skill at what you're doing for poker, that would be knowing the hands, knowing how to bluff, knowing how to do things for smash, that would be knowing the moves, etc. Then yeah, that holds. But yeah, my analogy holds for it too, in that you can play poker and just sit there and play a solid game. There's some play styles that play just a solid game. And others are really involved in trapping your opponent and right, what your opponent's going to do. Yeah, like poker, it's all about predicting what your opponent's going to do and like all that stuff. And it's it's, uh, it's very important. Like the optimal, like optimal, there's, there's like optimal playing poker and it's also just reading the shit out of your opponent and like doing... You know, crazy plays that nobody would predict. Yeah, that's true. Has anybody ever played Gran Turismo? Yeah, oh my god, dude. Let's talk Gran Turismo. Okay, so it's a little bit like Gran Turismo, but it needs a heavy modification. So, anybody else besides me and Q? I mean, it's a racing game. Uh, the only racing game I've played was Diddy Kong Racing. You see, it's not a racing game, Fire Blaster. It's a sim. Don't ever, yeah, don't ever get confused. Gran Turismo is a simulator. So I was asking if you played it, because if you played it, you know, multiplayer kind of sucks. Even if you have the same exact car, because you'll make a mistake and you'll lose like a second. And there's no way to have a race long enough to where you can, like, if you want to race racing somebody game. in Gran Turismo, you should game. sit down and do like a four hour race. Yeah, that's, that's a race in real life, man. Yeah, it's like a literal sim. You would have to do like an eight-hour NASCAR race. And so what I mean is it's a lot like Gran uh, Turismo, which only Q's can understand. But I'll those interactions have uh, to happen every no. time. Uh, uh, <laughs> the five star. No, don't even talk about it. <laughs> what I mean is instead of just racing a good race and winning, you have to actually beat your opponent every single turn. The word you're looking for is consistency. No, because you don't need consistency, because you can just, but you just have to add it up, and you have to beat your opponent at more turns. Now, this gets more complicated when you factor in kill shots, but... I play with Kirby, man, so I'm not used to having kill shots. People always say the F smash, but that's bullshit. That's why I rely so heavily on the up B. It's a go-to 100% kill. Other than that, Kirby doesn't have your uh, Luigi up B, your Falcon Punch... Um, you know, your Yoshi forward air, he Fox does have smash. Like, 
Oh, I mean, he what about the down air, man? The down, down air. air. Down no, air. No, that's fine. Look, look, but you're warping that and taking its kill factor and making it its hit. Like, he doesn't have... The down air is not a fucking... It's a spike, but it's not like a smash, man. Kirby has no power hit. That higher percentage down air is a spike. Like, really, It's a spike really at ridiculous. all levels. But, you know, all are. I'm, I'm not talking about oh. spike. I'm talking about something in the middle of the stage or anywhere you can hit your opponent with and kill him. Your rest level move. Anyways, yeah. yeah. The thing, the thing that they have in common, the most basic like game like mechanic is uh, like the meta game revolves around. It's a, it's a complicated version of rock paper scissors. That's what all fighting games come down to in poker. Yeah, that's why Smash isn't a fighting game because you can throw rock and I can move my fucking rock to the left of it and have a better chance. That's, that's why, why I said it's a complicated. Fighting. It's a complicated game of rock paper scissors. And in the side, I disagree one hundred percent. Why do you disagree with everything, man? It's not the point. <laughs> what? Who cares if I disagree? How is that the point? How is my disagreement the point? Why can't I just be allowed to disagree? And yeah, we move I'm on. That, like you gotta, to, like I I need to know what you're saying. <laughs> what I'm here. It, what's more important is what I'm not saying. Which is Fire Blaster. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Listen to me. What I'm not saying is Fire Blaster. That's a ridiculous claim that doesn't make any sense. But it does make complete sense. Different. Every every no, every but, decision oh, someone makes in a in a in a move dude, in a you fight. Understand? Hold on. Every every move someone makes in a let's say in a, in a match yeah, in, no, in Smash Blaster, Brothers. Understand? Hold on, let me finish. Hold on. Sounds totally legit. I just disagree. With you. But, no, let, let me finish what I'm saying. Every 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 move that someone can make. If Kirby drops down from the, you know at a, at, you know your opponents at you know below the platform of Kirby is at this angle and this platform whatever facing him that way. Like Kirby has had to do a, drop, a platform drop bear or whatever. Like everything that Kirby wow. does, the opponent has a solution to counter it. And and if the and the, and Kirby also has a wait. Move. What are we talking about? I would agree with you. I don't ever drop through platforms on people with Kirby ever. I'm yeah, I, I agree. Kirby has that. moves. That's an awful choice. Kirby has multiple moves that he can do, and the opponent. If Kirby decides yeah, to do yeah, move A, you know, if move A is drop to the platform bear, the opponent has a has a, has, a, has the most optimal move uh, against that, that, which is the counter. I would, right. So I would, and then Kirby. and then if Kirby right. if, if Kirby knows the opponent is going to do that to try to counter his move A, Kirby's going to do a counter to that counter, and then the opponent can like predict this as well, you know, go even deeper and predict that counter. So it's all just a really complicated game of rock paper scissors. No, I think you're just making up some, like, first off, I would never platform. I understand your point, but, like, yeah, but It doesn't reality, matter what you would do, dude. That's not, that's not the point. Right, like, you can look at it later and call it that fire blaster. A marble rolling down a hill, right? Or a rock. Or some fucking ball. Like, it looks like it's making a choice. You can roll it a couple of times and it'll take a different path. Right, but that's not it choosing to take those paths. What? Like, what I mean is, it's not, when you play fucking Smash Brothers, is it rock, paper, scissors? Are you choosing to do, it's not, if so, then there's like four, there's like at least 30 of these items. So it's rock, paper, scissors, beer, That's glass. That's what I said, it's a complicated bar, version of rock, paper, on. scissors. That's what I, I said, it's a complicated version of the game. I don't, I, I disagree, man. I but just, you just, you just, you just said it was. When did I say it? that's weird? You said that you just said there's 30 items, so instead of rock paper scissors, there's more than three. Obviously, you just agree that there it's... would. I said there would be. Look here, man. Just safe to make an assumption that I'm never arguing with my own point. But yeah, I said there would be. I was just thinking about what would make your possible point possible. Um, so, but it... so do you do you do you agree with this point? To every move that the, that a, a character can make on a specific you know scenario. The opponent can always do like a move. The be there's an optimal move you can do against that. Is there? Did the, did the Skype chat cut out? I don't know. A ask you. I need to think about that question. Let's go get something to drink. Like, what if so? A player does a move. 
Is there an optimal move to do against it? Yeah, that's what I'm asking. Is ask. there a yeah. best possible move to do against it? I guess so. And I don't, I don't, I don't mean just like, you know, a little bear. I don't mean like just something simple like that. I mean, it could be something like, you know, jump around, you know, hit from a different angle or something. That could be the move. Yeah, I'm not talking. Yeah, I'm... Uh, hobby, but rock isn't the best option against scissors. Rock beats scissors 100% of the time. It isn't the most optimal move. It, it, it actually is if it beats it 100%. Whatever move beats it the hardest and gets you the most gain. When did we say move. that moves beat each other move? We never established that. We established there could be an optimal move. We never established there was always a move that would beat it. <sighs> what? We never established there's always a move that would beat it. But there's always the most optimal move you can do against something. Sure. But again, so, rock the, so there's the, always some the, the most optimal choice you can do, right? So yeah. because of that, you knowing that your opponent's going to do the most optimal move against you, against what you're originally going to do, you can you can read that, and you can change your your original decision and be like, oh, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to counter your optimal move, so it's no longer the most optimal move, right? Right, but at this point, if you haven't gone back in time, do you actually do the move now? It's not about going back in time. It's about predicting that your opponent's gonna, you know, you know, think yeah. what you're gonna do. That's that's what makes it. That's what that's it's the basis of logic is, for right? scissors. Okay, okay, but what you're talking about is a fantasy that happens in your head. You don't actually it's, do a move mm, and go back and change it. You think? No, it's about it, reading the opponent. That's what happens in rock paper scissors. Yeah, that's what happens in rock paper scissors, but. It also, yes, you, you also read, read your, your opponent, opponent in Smash. Smash. But it's not the same. You it read your opponent in Smash. You think they're going to roll this way. You do a certain move because you think they're going to roll this way. It's the best thing to do. R right. But you don't automatically win that. If you, you choose, you if you pick the right way they're going to do something, then yes, you win. So you do, we're saying now that all you have to do in Smash is just... I, I don't know, man. This is just like kind You're of guessing silly. what they're I mean, going to do wanna, from previous here, circumstances. Man? Yeah, he's here. Okay, can you guys ask this stuff to him? Yo, I speak for stud. No, just speak for you. I just want to hear what you think. <laughs> <laughs> alright, alright, what's on your mind? I am the authority figure here. I'm saying, if you can re react, if, if you can predict what your opponent's gonna do and do the right move to counter everything they do, you win, right? I there's no exception to that rule. Absolutely. There you go. I agree. That's 100% correct. I don't understand how that makes one point or another. Weren't you it's, saying how that's it's... What, that's that's, that's the basis of rapid paper scissors. Okay, tell him that part. Okay. Now we're now we're taking into a game like a game of chance. That's that's something completely different. Mm, like smash this chance too. You just can't. Nobody can see the human mind has a, a limit of, of reaction time. The fastest, the average fast reaction speed of a you know competitive player is about 250 milliseconds, which is just for the record. I think that's about the standard human limit, quarter of a second. Is standard human rack two tenths of a yeah. second is about the limit. Now, a frame is six is about seventeen frames, sixteen or seventeen. Let's say sixteen. Yeah, it doesn't mean we can't differentiate frames. So that means we can only react in about nine of them. So that's about let's say let's be generous and say fifteen frames. Fifteen frames into the future, you you do not know what's gonna happen because you can't react to it, right? You no. cannot you cannot yeah. react to something two frames ahead and be like yeah and he was gonna be like no you can't do that. Right. Therefore the next fifteen Wait, frames. Wait no 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 are... you can react up to like nine. No Wait. no no that's fifteen frames two hundred fifty milliseconds is fifteen frames. Just take all the quantification out of this and, and bring me to the point because. Okay you cannot react that if there was that time span that's gonna happen in the future you know that quarter of a second later. You, you can't, like, that's that's the okay. luck part of the game. In fighting, in every fighting game, that's the luck part. That you, that okay. you have that lack of information. You have to get, you have to react to you. Not react, okay. you have to predict your opponent. Let okay. me let me provide what I think is the missing link to rock, paper, scissors, and then what you're saying about frames per second and, and predicting, which is which is prior, uh, prior experience, prior knowledge, um, the, of their past actions. The recognition of patterns. Absolutely. Yeah. Rock, paper, um, scissors. 
Rock, paper, scissors. Uh, I mean, there's no better way to express it, maybe, with rock, paper, scissors. Sure, there are general similarities between really any two games that people compete at. But Smash Brothers is not... What did you... Your thesis is statement fire is oh. like quote you. Smash Brothers at the end of the day is a complex game of paper, rock, scissors, like other fighting games. Yeah. Is that a quote? Sure, not, yeah. Not of me, but it works. I think that that's completely untrue. I play so, so I have a question for you, quick question. Is there ever an instance where you totally agree with someone a hundred percent? Sure. <laughs> if somebody right now said, You're right. If, they just agreed if I agreed you, with you, that's the only it? time that you'll actually agree. No, but I mean, if somebody says they agree with me right now, do you think I'll just change it? No, 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 no. no. <laughs> Besides <laughs> that <laughs> one instance. <laughs> See, um... Oh, Ryan, you. <laughs> I'm pretty... I like playing DK. Um... I like playing DK. Just backing out, but what, I'm, I don't think that Smash Brothers is a complex game of paper rock too. It, it you is. You just it choose is. a move and you're guaranteed 100%. It has elements of I mean, rock, paper, scissors. It, it's, it's logical. If your opponent doesn't move and you always have the op, the best move and the worst move you can do against that move, you have to predict that he's gonna, you know, what he's gonna do so you can make your op like move. It's poker, where you can do the Poker apps. is also a complicated game of rock, paper, scissors. No, man. Yeah. yeah. Use the phrase "it's complicated" to mean you can do all the best moves and still lose. I mean, if I didn't, you do the I best, never said that. Why secondly, would I... again, my second point to destroy this is that a poor way to describe rock versus scissors is to say it's the most optimal move. You're already shading it there. It's not the most optimal move. It's What's... the correct move that guarantees it's the win condition. Isn't that well, what optimal it, means? That, that's what optimal that's what means. Optimal means. Sure, but that's like saying that if you're given to if you're given a, a bunch of foods and some of them poison you and some of them don't, the idea is you want to eat the most optimal one. So if I give you three that are poison, yeah. you would eat the the yeah. If you're if you're poisonous. stranded on an island and you couldn't and this, Listen, there was a bunch of food that was poisonous, but there was, was food that was less poisonous, answer. you want to eat the less poisonous food. That's the most optimal move, food. No, the optimal <laughs> move is to not eat any of the fruit in and, and, and starve. Fruit. But no Boom. one's gonna argue here that the best way to play Super Smash Bros. is not to play it, dude. <laughs> That's no, no, amazing. <laughs> <laughs> that is the you best thing rock. I've heard all night. <laughs> throw rock and I throw rock. I can sometimes, if I set it up right, I can back away soon enough to not have that encounter. That's if you not, throw that's, scissors, that's, I throw that, that, that is another move. That's not, that's not rock. That is a different move than rock. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, because it's, it's, it's more complicated. That's what I'm saying. Rock scissors is not quantum paper rock scissors. The quantum. Wow. I'm gonna stroke out. Hipster. With the slap. <laughs> oh, it's more still. Um, I don't know, man. Sometimes stu you still talk about this game like it's a game, you know? And I get that, but. Like, there's a certain point where, like, when you want to improve at something, you have to remove the laws of the game itself and, like, accept the fact that that to be outplayed is to be outclassed, is to be, is, is for someone to have thought of something you did not, it, to have, to have, to, for someone to have done something that you did not expect or did not rule. No, it's one of those things you'll I never absolutely expect agree, and you. that's why I say, with few exceptions, I am the greatest fucking Smash Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you you doing, uh, though? My point still stands. About, but about hey, you scissors. play tennis, right? Q, you ever you ever uh, ran to somebody better than you in tennis? You guys, all you're doing here is trying to define no, what Q skill is. Now, Q is the best tennis, tennis player in the world, dude. Skill in fighting games is the ability to like read your opponent. Yeah. It doesn't matter. You're not immune from circle jerking. Just because you can this conversation someone, has made me better at Smash. All the people in the immediate area, you still have to define the things you say in fucking reality of the game. Alright. You can't just jib jabber because you get top eight. I'm not. I, 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 I you know what? I don't think there's only one person jib jabbering. Man. You know, I ever since ever since Apex, I have not once brought up like my place in that Apex. Yeah, Everyone I think other people have brought me, it up, but I never like said like, hey guys, I got top eight. Like no, like I never I'll say bring that. I'll it up again. Fire Blaster got top eight. It was fucking awesome.
Who cares? Yeah, you bring I that. I feel like I could have the most technical I've been saying, like, I've everyone. been saying fighting games are like rapid processors since, like, way before. Yeah, man, a chess is a lot like, like if I put on all of my time into DK, my DK would be scared. Hey, um, Hipster, <laughs> do you think you have more tech skill than a uh, Wizrobe? What? Like what? Wizrobe's got my vote for future after LB. Do you think you have as much tech skill as as Wizrobe? Like technical ability? Yeah, just just technical ability, um, not like skill at all, just ability. Like te technical about ability to do shit. shit oh, that's tough, dance, man. I like, can't really play Yoshi. And stuff. I, I, I don't know. even know what Yoshi does. When I fight Yoshi, like I know how the matchup goes, but I have no idea. Like, like what's I going try on to in play this game? Yeah. When I try to play as Yoshi and do what Yoshi players do to me, I can never figure out how it works. Yeah, I can. I know yeah, how to fight same. him. It's like I don't know man. who's harder. Like I think Fox and Yoshi are definitely the two most Yoshi's technical just players. Yoshi's a weird character to play as for me. I, like I'm fine. I don't know which one is more technical though. Hey, yeah. Fire Blaster, you play both of them pretty well. Who do you think's more technical, Yoshi or Fox? Um, shit. Uh, <laughs> um, What's that even mean in that context? I think, I mean, Fox, I think the only, the only hard thing about Fox is the shine. Um, I think Yoshi, well, I think Yoshi's harder to play in terms of technical skill. Yeah, I, I agree with that. Fire Blaster on that. It's harder to know if Yoshi was the right move. Uh, maybe with Fox. Yeah, I mean, Fo all of Fox's, I mean, Fox's recovery sucks, yeah, and all that stuff, and, but like, his moves are really, really good. Uh, yeah, yeah Fox is like the like... best move pool out of all the characters. Yeah, I think so. I agree about Yoshi because well, Yoshi also has a great Yoshi. move pool. Like, name one move that Yoshi has that you cannot use. Right. Like, he just, like, doesn't have one. Well, I think that's a stupid attitude on some of the characters. Like, what does Fox have that you can't use? Same thing. Those are two characters, like. Oh, all moves are special, bro. Don't like, there's, like, Kirby up air sucks. We can all admit that, right? Like, yeah, like you can use it, but it's not like... Here's a great fucking point. Somebody who's good at this game, man, which is everybody in this phone call, get, like, take a fucking second and sit there and tell me with a straight face that that up air is not an okay move. It's, it's pretty bad. It's really bad. I mean, it has its uses, and they're very, very few uses. It has the, uses. probably one of the least useful like, use, moves in the I, game. Can I challenge you to rephrase that? And I would say, well, I think it's more likely that, honestly, no one's been forced to use it, but that we just don't have the skill to use that move appropriately. I can agree with that to some extent. I, I can't agree with that. We we know what moves angle and, and project on you know, the not project the knockback. You fucking baiter! I don't. We know what the knockback and the moves and the properties, and uh, we know what. Yeah, it's I know what you guys think process. on this really low le like Q man. I've, I've seen Matt's use it. Your well. accusations, but I think that I'm sorry. Like I love you guys. You know, keep playing the game. Keep playing it well. But if you want to talk about if, this, like, I mean, high level of wrong, stuff, like, if you want to prove me wrong, then all of us, you can go I don't care my about it. I'm not on the same level as you. That's what you don't get. We're on different levels of talking about the game. I know, but if you want to convince someone that a move is good, you know, you gotta show that it's good. Otherwise, people are just gonna believe, you know, right, you know, right, right, so that, like. I'm ever arguing that I'm only arguing oh, that I'm only arguing that moves are good because you guys are arguing that right, any I actually of them think are I'm done bad. playing, man. We've been playing for a while. Yeah, dude. Let's take a little break, man. Yeah, that was fun, though. I mean, Bro, relatively... Where are you at? Stream the Fire Blaster. Every other move has, like, really good properties, and that one doesn't. No, man. Look, I'm just sorry. You guys are just wrong with this whole moves are good and bad thing. It's well, a you bad can't, way say, you can't keep I'm saying you're wrong if you can't prove it. So you're saying, Stessel, that every move is equally as good as every other one? Yeah, man, I'm saying that moves are merely collections of hitboxes. And yeah, some of them, I guess, preferably throw out hitboxes to where you like, but at the end of the day, man, you can use any of them. Maybe maybe a different word here. Is every move as applicable as any other move? move? To, like, for me, that's, that's a clear cut, no. Yeah, I agree with that. I mean... Sure, some of them are easier or harder, and depending on how much time you have, some of them can just buy bulk, or not bulk, but buy just 
I don't know, man. Out. The finite does not okay. be there. So, but if, if be time is a factor point. here, like, there's no amount of time that you can provide to make Samus's up B, or I mean, not up B, Samus's up air, or Kirby's up air, any better than if if you're in a, you know, sticky situation. Better at what? Be better in terms of it being the cor not, not the correct move, but the the opt I'm sorry, but optimal is just the best word here. Yeah. Like, no, no, man. Like, let's let's get let's just walk this down like like formally, man. Again, so better at what you said, just better, just being optimal. Optimal. So right like, choice. compare Jiggly's up a or up tilt to Kirby's up tilt. Man, I'm sorry, again, when do you just, when is it that you're just choosing optimal moves, Q? Um, when, when I am pressured to make a decision, like, um, I'm, I, if I'm back into a corner and, you know, especially, like, up against the ledge, like, uh, there are certain players that are good at that, and, like, you only have a few choices, you can back down or you can fucking fight through back to the middle of the stage, but, like, um, only some moves are gonna get that done for you, as, like, I, I don't know. And two of the moves that I would not bank on that move, so, it seems it's up air or Kirby's up air. Uh, more, no way. A more direct comparison is. I, okay, wait, tell me, like, Jimmy Club's up tilt versus Kirby's up tilt. A goddamn move. Yeah, that's what I was saying. You're not talking about any kind of in situation. You guys are just having a, like, Oprah Winfrey show kind of talk about the game, and I'm never. It's Yo, Dude, if we're having an Oprah Winfrey show, then you're fucking Oprah. So that's still. <laughs> I like this over there being like. Oh, you guys are writing the fan fiction, and that's legit. You get a Kirby up B. You get a Kirby up B. Kirby up B. <laughs> like, that's ridiculous that you agree that every move can be used equally as well as other moves. Like, that's just wrong, dude. When I fire earlier, so he kills me twice with Yoshi, and I tied it up at 2 2, okay? This is my thought process. <laughs> so, I, I noticed over these stock uh, uh, this. You're cutting out. It's really hard to understand you. Anyway. So I realized that Fire Blaster is doing this thing with Yoshi where he's serious, it's the last game, so he's going to be doing the same thing, and he's running under the main platform. It's this tiny little route that I've noticed he was doing at the start, because the, under the main platform is a good place to be as long as you're in transit, right? So I can't just time a drop down, uh, down air and crush him. So I realized this, and on that last kill, man, I just fucking do a rock through the platform. Rock it up. None of these moves are up air. Like, <laughs> I, I need to know. Let, let me put it this way. It takes um, forever, and I hit with it because I it, just he was it's gonna... a high percentage move, right? Like they, you are forcing them to make a decision to either keep going forward or to to uh, di back off the ledge and, and actually grab the ledge. That's what the rock is doing. You're, you're forcing a decision between A and B, and, and you know what those outcomes are going to be. What? No. Look, I'm talking about I spawned, dropped it up, and just did a rock. Dropped straight down, dropped through, and just did a rock. The whole thing took about three seconds. He saw the whole thing, and it still smashed into it. Because I timed his mental subroutine the point where he had already committed to what I expected to be long enough to put him with reaction time and everything. And I'm talking about way more than a quarter of a second. I'm talking about three seconds here. I timed it to know that he was going to be there then. And I did it. And that's what I'm talking about. When you guys start talking about move choice or whatever, the times when you get hits with predictive reads, which I know, because I do all the fucking time, is when your opponent doesn't have a choice. Because if they did, they would obviously get out of it, or they'd just react out of it, for Christ's sake. Right, right. But again, it's still... Smash is still, like... Um... Like, so we just put it this way, okay? If Kirby had Falcons up air for his up air, Kirby below the stage would actually recover. Right. Someone turn on video, please. Video? 
Someone just turn on their video. I don't need to see your face to know how serious you are right now, man. I'm not. I'm doing something else. So just one other person, please turn on their video. <laughs> I'm not gonna turn on their video. I guess my Still point is that. that, like... Any other person in the call for about 30 seconds. Um... The, the creation of opportunities and the elimination of options, um is what makes some moves a better decision than other moves. That That is that is where this argument comes from, Stesla. It's not to say that some moves are just not applicable in all situations. That That's not quite true. But it's also not to say that the game designers knew what they were